Hello, my name is Ken Korn and I am a product specialist down here at Camping World of Asheville. And I'm gonna do a video tour of this amazing camper right here. This is a 2023 Airstream Bambi 22FB. So the FB stands for a bed in the front. It's 22 feet of living space. And of course, I just absolutely love the space age design, all the polished aluminum as if it was a, an airplane or something like that. And these are really cool campers. So let's jump inside and check it out. And here we go right up the steps right here. You got one step because it's kind of low profile, low to the ground. And look at that. You've got your own little air stream foot pad right here to wipe off your feet as you go inside here and now let me pan up and just show you the inside here got you a nice little uh magnet board right here so you can uh, write down a grocery list or whatever you need right there and look at these little hooks right here here's your little sweeper right there a little little uh, fly swatter right there very nice they thought of everything in the airstream just go ahead and go right up here into the rear bathroom right there as you can see there's more of that polished aluminum you know and that really bounces the light around in here so everything is just open and airy even though the windows are smaller you've got your a toilet right there and then you've got your uh, stainless steel sink look at that Real stainless steel right there, or aluminum one. So it's an actual metal sink. Then of course you've got some storage up under here. Oh, they've thought of everything. It even has the toilet roll right there. Of course, some more storage over here. Slide open storage for linens right there. And of course, your heat is right through those air ducts right there. And then this is really cool. How about this? Tankless hot water heater on an Airstream. How about that? Very cool. Now, you've got the rotating mirror that comes out. Look at that. Ooh, who's that ugly guy? But nice. Look at that. They have just thought of everything on a nice chrome stem right there. And then, of course, let's take a look at this shower right here. A glass shower door. And then, of course, a fully enclosed shower. No matter how much splashing around or everything. It is a molded shower tub right here, so it is all together as one. Now check this out if you need some uh, space to uh, dry off some of your clothes, check that out. It actually has a little string right there that pulls right out of the wall so you can hang your wet clothes up after you take a shower. Isn't that amazing? They have just absolutely thought of everything in this guy. Now, right outside of the bathroom door right there is a max air fan right there. That is going to pull all that moisture right out the roof there. So you don't have to worry about any kind of moisture here inside your camper. So right next to the bathroom door, check it out. Look at the size of that closet and all that hanging storage right there very nice very deep i got my whole arm in here and you also have a light that just comes right on when you open up the door how about that like i said airstream has thought of everything and then of course right here you've got a television that has a telescoping arm on it of course so you can rotate it around right next to that is your refrigerator right there Got you a nice little refrigerator that also has a little freezer rack there up on top. But that's really all you need right here in this guy. Even got some ice. Look at that. It's got an ice chest with it too. All right. So here's your kitchenette area right here. And let me show you how it has the microwave. You got a pull-out drawer. Comes down like that. Here you've got a Suburban 2i cooktop right there. Uses gas. And then of course you have your double, look how deep that sink is. That looks like something that would be in your house. That is a huge sink for this size of a camper. And it has the cutting board on the top and it also gives you extra prep space if you need it. A GFI outlet right there in case you need an air fryer or anything like that. And then of course you've got the two cabinets. Look at this right up underneath got your oh look at that that's something you don't always find you even have a little silverware cubby right there how about that and there is your 
trash can. Now I've got to show you the overhead bins. I just absolutely love these overhead bins. They just, they just roll right back. Look at that. They do, they just roll right back. How about that? I didn't know that they were flexible, but they do. They just roll right back. So you got some overhead bins and this one hides the radio. So you do have stereo speakers in here. I'm gonna show you that right quick. There's your stereo speakers. And you have them on the inside here for your entertainment. Opposite of your kitchen area right here is the dinette table. And this dinette table is not fixed. It moves around. I especially like the rounded edges because if the TV's right over there and you wanna put your feet up, you put your feet up this way or you can put your feet up that way right there. And you know what? If this table's kinda of like in the way, well heck, why don't we just move it a little bit here, we can uh, move it around this way, like that, or it can slide back and forth. How about that? It can get closer to you or further away. So lots of different ways you can use this. You can put it over here, just relax right here, put your feet up like that. And then you got your little table right here for viewing your television and that sort of thing. Very comfortable, very nice. And what I also wanted to show you is that there is storage up underneath both of these pads. There you see the little storage access door right there. So you do have storage on both sides of the benches right there. The opposite bench here, there is also more storage as well. Let me remove these pads right here and show you. This one actually has two access ports right here one two for storage up under there but hey you know what if i don't want to remove these pads on the back side of the wall there's actually an access door here to get into that same area so you have three different ways of getting into your storage right here right here in the dining area you also have another max air fan right there to pull all of that air through your camper here's another speaker and your light and of course i wanted to show you the air conditioner right quick that also has a heat strip in it too so you can knock off the chill inside your camper uh, without using your propane you just use the electricity that you're already paying for in the campground now lastly but not least here is the bedroom area, a nice big queen size bed right there. And of course, above that, you have some more of those sliding up cubbies right there. So cool the way they just, they're metal on the outside, but they have a flexible back. So they slide right into the wall right there. Look at all of those windows. You've got two windows on either side for a cross breeze if you need it. Nice big pillows and all that kind of good stuff. It's very nice in here. There is a heat vent right down there. And then of course up under the bed there is also storage. Look at all of that storage up under here. I mean just loads of it. Lots of storage up under the bed. There's another better look right there of all the storage up under the bed. And there's also access panels over here as well. So you have access to everything, that's for sure. And then over here on this side, you have a little hideaway cubby hole right here. How about that? And then up above that, another hideaway cubby right in there. How about that with a little cover right here and of course both sides have your outlets right here your usb outlets and your outlets gfi outlet and a beautiful accent touch right here is the nice frosted glass panels that's in between the bedroom and your cooking and dining area and of course it has these nice curtains that go right across give you a little bit of privacy right there. Back outside here, I'm gonna show you a few of the things on the campsite of this uh, fabulous trailer here. This is just, I just absolutely love the aerodynamic design to that. And of course the outside amenities, they've done the same thing. They've really thought of everything. So first of all, I wanna show you that yes, it does have an awning and it's an easy awning, even though it's not power, 
but it's really easy to do. So let me show you. I'll demonstrate right quick. All you got to do, this right here comes on the inside, and all you have to do, flip the locks here, flip the lock over here, reach up with this hand and get it in that little hook right there. And get that inside. It's real easy to do. Now, I'm just barely pulling. on a spring so it pulls right out look at that very nice awning right there it pulls out like this and then of course when you're done you just roll it just rolls right back in right there very easy to do who needs power when it's that easy right above that awning right there look at that you've got a solar panel on the campsite of the camper that's going to help your battery stay charged up again airstream has thought of everything let me show you the front here you've got a power tongue jack right here you've got two 20 pound uh, lp gas bottles up here and it's actually big enough you can put two 30 pound lp gas bottles up there if you want to double battery box right here what I really like are these tinted windows in the front that actually open. Look, you got a little piece right here and a piece over there. And then on the inside, it just cranks right out. So really cool windows up front to protect the front of your camper from any kind of gravel or anything like that. Now we're going to go down the non-camp side right here. Now let me show you. There it is. There's that tankless hot water heater right there. Some more of those beautiful windows. I really like these aluminum wheels. They look real cool and they have Goodyear tires on them. Made in America. Thank you very much that it's got Goodyear's tires. Smart plug, camp power, cable TV right here if you want cable TV. An outdoor shower. And then of course, here's your water inlet. Here's your black water flush tank. And of course, there's your black water right down there and a place to hide your hose and over here on the non-camp side check it out there is two solar panels so you've got double the solar panels to keep those batteries charged up and of course you do have hd tv antenna that is also wi-fi ready it does come with a backup camera how about that this is an amazing camper if you want to come down here and take a tour of this great camper, please come see Ken down here at Camping World of Asheville.